going to head to the Celestial Palace as we go to game number three of this best of three series, Blacklist International versus Aura PH. Tara na. Ang comfort para sa Blacklist International na dyan ang YSS ni Wise or the Wise SS. And like we said kanina, Edward as well as Ohev using the same heroes in the past uh, three games that we have. And also, it all spells comfort para sa Blacklist. Kung mapapansin mo yung first item na kinuha ni Kilowash, yung region, ano, yung region necklace. Yes. Region necklace, dalawang ganun yung kinuha niya yeah, dito. This is not the first time that he did that. Um, kay, uh, usually, ginagawa niya ni Kilowash lang na pag mga Chou Thumbs siya. Gusto niyang i-out sa state lane katapat, dalawang necklace sa simula. Really helps him to be uh, tanky in a way, or sustain me. Then again, alam niya din na hindi talaga favorable matchup sa kanya dito yung top lane na may pakito. So ang ginawa, ginagawa niya dito is nagkakatch ng wave. Yeah. And kaila, hindi, hindi niya gusto na madala siya dun sa my critical uh, HP. So ibig sabihin dito, ladies and gentlemen, Kilowash really just wants to go for uh, yung mga cut ng waves. We did see kanina nung, uh, nung game 1 na yung, yung Pakito versus uh, Benedetta matchup. Dahil sa mga nerfs sa Benedetta, sighted talaga siya sa Pakito kung uh, sa bayang bigkas lang mangyayari. But when it comes to um, cutting waves, obviously, nandun niya kay Benedetta kasi meron siya maraming dash and pwedeng gamitin ni Kilowash yun. Ngayon, nung nangyari nung game number one was etong ating uh, Benedetta, ang ginawa niya ay ina-advance niya yung pag ng waves para si Pakito ay maiwan dun sa lane. Maka kailangan niya mag-depensa kasi otherwise ma-push yun. Kaya naman, napigilan yung play making potential ni Edward kasi kinakailangan niya pinapwersa siya ni Kilowash na magstay dun sa lane and nakikita niyo din si Eson talaga pinupulit niya dito si JP manhook niya kaya yung buff hindi niya mahook yung buff and as that is going to be Kilowash and Edward going at it pareho na silang level 3 dito and kung mapapansin mo si Edward pa yung nabawasan ng todo dun sa ginawa nilang suntukan yeah. Now, in the middle, ito naman yung hinahanap natin para kung may Venus yung uh, Eve with that second skill. At uh, si Raflesha nagiging problema, problema lang para sa Blacklist International. 1 minute 40 seconds in, hindi pa level 4 si Wise dahil nga naman sa ito fact na hindi pa niya makukuha yung purple niya. <laughs> and Raflesha dito and Eson going at it. And look at that flicker. Finn Licker siya pabalik. Tignan natin Raflesha mga katakas nga ba. And si Kilowash with the help. Flicker out para kay Venus dito. And that is going to be crucial para sa kanila, Raflesha, nakatakas pa. Wow, that's the power of the Grok. Uh, high and dry with the sprint. Hit up a bullet for sure. At kaya maging uh, really offensive the, the start of the match. Edward, the first target dito ng Aura PH. And nandito yung backup, pero medyo late ang pangyayari. The hook will be thrown out, pero si Kilowash nagstay siya doon ng onte para kahit pa pa. Oh, no. Uy, nagka nagkabarilan! Na. Yung isa sa taas, yung isa sa harap! And that's exactly what we said into the draft. Yung Eve uh, gonna be counter. Hindi mag counter de. Answered by Greed. Nung nakita niya nag ultimate na si Eve, alam niya that there's only one spot literally for that. At tatanggapin niya talaga yung meteor shower. Sabay last hit pa ni JP. And obviously, wanna give that to Nairo in the early game. Now, belongs to Aura PH. Nakuha pa nila yung turtle. Ngayon, alam nila na vulnerable dito si Venus sa mga ganks. Kasi wala siyang flaker. Nagamit na yung flicker na pwersa nila kanina. So, ibig sabihin nito si Greed, lalaban at lalaban talaga ng harapan to. And we might see another pressure dito sa may mid lane para kay Venus. Hindi uh, magtitigil ang Aura PH. Lalong lalo ngayon ang ganda nung simula para sa kanila. They will use their Benedetta to cut the waves. Tapos kuwa, gawa sila ng play with the Lancelot. And all is good para sa Aura PH. Lalo na, na lumalamang na sila ng isang libo ngayon. Uh, para naman sa Blacklist International, they have to force rotations. Oh, look at this, Greed! Kinuha agad, ninaka agad yung purple buff. We are talking about this, the Aura PH jungle choke tactics. Ito yung mga bagay na talaga nakakasakit ng todo sa isang YSS. Like YSS, sinabi na nga natin, consistent siya. Pero kasi yung strength niya is kailangan pa rin niya yung buffs. Mm -hmm. So, ibig sabihin dito, Aura just took like 2 minutes, 1 minute and 30 seconds of that buff dito sa side ng Blackhawks International and yung effectivity dito ng Blackhawks International is magle-lessen ng onte yes. in terms of the jungler side. Aura PH push it up. And you can see Kilowash na nakapa niya yung green buff na yun away from Wise. Uh, can't catch a break. Oh, although... Oh, there is a fight. The hook is there. Eson dito, mapipilitan gamitin yung flicker niya. And Edward na naman ang naipit doon. 
Divide and conquer. Ang pinapakita ng Oka dito, Wolf. Not exactly what is happening ngayon. Just like in the previous game, kung saan napupwersa ang Blacklist International na maghiwahiwalay dahil dun sa movements ito ng Aura PH. Hindi man YSS yung gamit ng Aura ngayon. They're using the last slot. Almost is the same. At ngayon, 12 seconds before the turtle timing, nagiging aggressive na naman ang Aura. Wanna kill all my Venus or at least get a bonus kill. Sabay pwesto dun sa may turtle. At kukuha ngayon ang uh, big objectives. Wise hindi na nakakuha ng buff saldo na last hit ngayon, which is great. That's exactly what they wanted. Para dun sa para kay Wise. And a uh, glowing one para dito kay sa side ni Greek. Kilowash with the brute force blast plate. Rafli siya dito. Meron siyang passive so hindi siya mahatak At the surprise siya dito. Eson gets the kill. Pero doon sa may likod, Greek dito. Pinoforce out niya sila. Oheb, Kilowash. Try to get away. Makakatakas ba siya? Yes, he can. May hook na pwedeng tumama. And here comes the electro final blow. Eson dito. Hinarangan talaga nila. Hindi tatama yung pana. And the hook will be thrown out din ulit ng isa pang beses. Ooh. Hindi pa rin mauuli si Kilowash. Masyadong madulas ang Kilowash. Ang dulas. Oh, this Benedetta by Oheb. Sabi niya, it's just trade for a turret. And big influx of gold para sa side ng Blacklist International. Lalo na nakakuha sila ng imported kills naman sa Aura. And this one, dying once again. Top lane para kay Wise naman. Using his ultimate to scout things out. Sabay back dahil alam niya na doon na si Kilowash. And Aura PH... Even after getting so many good um, stops in the early game, mo pa lang na blacklist. In fact, malit lang yung lead, 500, 600 lang yung lead na Aura PH. Read ang main target nila dito. Tinatakbo talaga nila Harith at sabi din ni Benny Cutie dito. Taka, pre, alis na. Diyan natin kaya to si Edward. Gusto pa rin yung slow, ibabato. Pero doon Ooh. sa may gitna, may 1v1 na naganap. And JP clearly having the advantage, still gets the kill. That uh, is a very important kill. Kaso nga lang patay si Grok, but that is just a tank. And Aura PH, hindi naman sila ganun kalungkot kung sa nangyari na yun. In fact, masayang masaya pa sila dahil binigyan nila ng kill, solo kill. etong si JP. Ngayon ay lumalamang kay uh, YSS. In fact, JP is leading by 600 gold in the early stages over his um, jungler counterpart, which is Wise. And alam natin, crucial yun. Si Benny Cutie, two items na. That's true. Okay. Naka-clock of destiny na. And talisman. Tapos may enchanted talisman pa. So, ibig sabihin, magiging mahirap to come in the coming mid-game kasi masyadong maaga nakuha ni Benny Cutie yung mga timings ka dito. Especially yung stacks. Kasi usually, kapag mataas din yung gold ni Alice, nagko-convert din yan sa maraming stacks na eh. Yes, ang pinaka... Um, favorite na hero, pinakakabisado na hero ni Benny Cutie is the Alice. Uh, arguably one of the best uh, Alice players in the league right now. We'll see him really snowball this time. And Oheb dito getting pop, pop lock and drop. Ooh, Benny sakit. Cutie, mahuhuli pa siya ni Eve dito. Oh. And Eson, gusto niya huli ni JP and the hook! Hook flicker! Sexy moves mula kay uh, Uncle Eson. Baka uh, Eson Esports! Eson Esports! Inintay niya yung turn rows, pops the hook, flicker out, solid na solid. Walang kawala doon yung Lancelot. By the way, Oh My Venus facilitated for that with a wonderful usage of the ultimate. This time kasi ginamit naman niya yung walls para hindi siya makita. Oh, grabe. Uy! Oh, 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 oh. oh my goodness, look at that play. Kilowash dito, nahatak siya. Wala lang sa pwesto yung mga members dito ng Blacklist International. Pero, masasabi natin na nahuli na ni Eson si Kilowash. Oo. Oh. At hindi yan siguro ang pinakahuli, Eson, mananalasa pa. And all of a sudden, Butters, Blacklist International ahead of Aura PH. Pwedeng-pwede na sila kumuha ng mga next objective sa ngayon. Gamitin nila si Oh My Venus in an offensive manner, just like into the bottom lane. Nag-drawing na dito si Oh My Venus. And hindi makataka si Kilowash dun sa pwestong yon Kilowash dito, first set of the game. Pero kung napapansin nyo, unti-unti nang pumupunta yung momentum dito sa side ng Blacklist International. Ora, sila yung nag-set ng tempo, sila yung nag-set ng pacing kanina, but right now, that isn't the case. Blacklist dito, with the efforts of their uh, members, talagang nababaliktad na nila dito yung tide. Now, waiting just for the perfect timing. Although may two items dito si Benny Cutie, they still need more. And para naman dun sa Grok, it's a defensive manner at nauna kasi yung Blacklist! Kanina pinag-usapan natin to Wolf, pagka nakapwesto ng una ang Blacklist International, sila ang mananalo and Aura PH dito. Masasabi na natin na nawala na yung control ng mapa sa kanila. Oh, definitely. Kasi they're sitting far behind and 
Hinihintay talaga nila doon. And the hook! <laughs> Putting up a show! The S on Esports Show, ladies and gentlemen! Oh. Kung nakikita niya ang taong yan, ang lakas mong hatak! Angel Eson! Tinapos! Tinapos si Eson! Kumbaga si Eson, wala kang takas dito! Kung maghanap ka ng Joe, maghanap ka ng Eson! Nobody else can play the Franco this way. Pinroof na na yan sa mga tournaments outside of the MPL. Ang nakita mo naman, Greed, suma sidestep. Pero alam ni Eson kung saan siya pupunta. And the slow-mo with the flicker. Beautiful play from Eson. Hindi na nga kinailangan yung ulti kasi nga naman, yun know, basic na. And that instant replay is brought to you by Oppo A94. Experience gaming at full speed with Oppo A94. Available starting March 26 in Oppo Concept Stores, Retail Partners, and Ecom Platforms. Pero may away na nagaganap dito habang nag ispiel ako. Pwede na natin labanan to. Nandito sa may pinakalikol. Edward dito lumalaban and greed. Kapipilitan tumakbo. Harris dito. Divide and conquer pala lang ruin nyo. Babalik namin sa inyo yung favor. JP and Kilowash. Wala silang magawa kay Edward. The Filipino champ. Tinitipia pa sila dito. And that's going to be a Triple kill! Para kay Oheb! Oh my goodness! Look at that spacing coming out from Blacklist International. At sabi nga natin, pag sila talaga ang nauna nasa pwestuan, inista mo na. Blacklist International obviously using yung kanilang Yi Sun Jin to uh, take control of the vision game. Sabay uh, gamit yung kanilang uh, harit kay Oheb. And even with Benny Cutie having three items na, meron na siyang Winter Truncheon. Hindi pa rin enough yung damage output ng Aura PH. And we have to see Kilowash really Give something para sa team niya. And this uh, Benedetta, after all of the nerves, hindi na siya yung pinaka-solid na side laner na alam natin na meron ang Benedetta dati. Sa ngayon, kay ang, ang kailangan mong gawin ay mag-clear lang talaga ng waves. And Aura BH, stuck. Na-quarantine sila dito sa base nila. Oo. Oh, Mountain Shocker revealed that lahat sila nandun. So lahat ng waves, lahat ng waves, lahat ng lanes nagpo-push papunta dito sa side ng Aura. Kailangan nilang i-defend to. An attack on all angles. Ga ika nga nila Wolf. Roughly siya dito and the others. They really try to take down the Lord. Pero si Y sila Oheb. Si Edward. Iba ang nasa isip. Tutu ba yung toka dito sa may gitna. Depensa alam nila yung taas. Yung babae. Kita hindi. Pero another one. Coming out here. From Meso de Esports. Hook after hook after hook. Hook City. Parang kay Meso de Esports. Lahat talaga na huli. Lahat na tatali. Even with the figure use. Na madami man siyang binabato at madami yung mimintis Pero pag tumama, talagang solid na solid Eson Esports paving the way The surprise niya si Croc And another one si Croc. And another one And another one Benny Cutie goes down Blacklist International takes the series 2-1 to one. Oh my goodness, tignan natin Ah, wala akong words. You have to get, you really have to give it to Eson. You're crucial.